There is a slight difference between permanent mold and sand casting and it really has to do with the tooling itself. Um, permanent mold is what it sounds like. It's a permanent mold. It's steel. So you're going to use it multiple times over and over again. Whereas sand, you are using sand as the mold, so you're going to have to break it apart every time. The difference for a steel tool versus any of the other processes is repeatability. Um, surface finish is obviously one of the benefits to permanent mold over sand casting. When you're using sand casting, you're creating an impression in sand, so it gives you a coarser um, surface finish. There is the chance of sand entrapment potentially happening, whereas in permanent mold, you are using just a steel mold. One of the other great benefits of permanent mold is lower porosity in your castings. The good thing about having lower porosity is when you go to machine them, you don't have as many issues. Um, denser castings are also great in the pressure vessel industry. Porosity can cause issues in powder coating and finishing. You can also hold tighter tolerances with permanent mold, which is a big advantage. This is also a great example of when you want to switch from sand to permanent mold. Um, one, due to volume, um, just due to the sheer need of higher quantity, this was a good part to switch to permanent mold, in addition to reducing the amount of porosity that comes through and the potential of sand entrapment. We're the permanent mold experts and we've been in business for over 75 years.